if a is equal to 2 minus 3 5 3 2 minus 4 1 1 minus 2 find a inverse using a inverse solve the system of equations 2x minus 3y plus 5z is equal to 11 3x plus 2y minus 4z is equal to negative 5 and x plus y minus 2z is equal to negative 3 so first let us find a inverse for that let's find that a determinant of a matrix a is equal to determinant of 2 minus 3 5 3 2 negative 4 1 1 and negative 2 which is equal to so we can write here 2 times of 2 into minus 2 is minus 4 and 1 into minus 4 minus 4 so negative of negative 4 is plus 4 and second one minus of minus plus 3 times of because here we have the sign plus minus and plus so we can add plus 3 times of 3 into minus 2 is negative 6 and minus 1 into 4 is plus 4 we can write and then again plus 5 times of 3 into 1 3 minus 2 into 1 is 2 so we can write it's a 2 into 0 plus 3 into negative 2 plus 5 into 1 so we can add negative 6 plus 5 which is negative 1 which is not equal to 0 and hence we can say that a inverse exists and we know that a inverse is equal to 1 by delta into adjoint of a matrix a and adjoint of a matrix is adjoint of a matrix is equal to transpose of the cofactor matrix cofactor matrix of a whole transpose so let us find the cofactor matrix by using the shortcut method so let's start from the second row second column say from here 2 then minus 4 then 3 and 2 so let me write here 2 negative 4 3 and then again 2 coming to the next third row again starting from the middle number 1 and the next number is minus 2 and the next number again it comes 1 then again plus 1 and coming to the first row minus 3 5 2 and minus 3 and again coming back with the second row 2 negative 4 3 and 2 so we will have the determinants here we can write here adjoint of a matrix is equal to cofactor matrix is 2 into minus 2 minus 4 plus 4 it's 0 and here we can write minus 4 plus 6 is 2 next 3 minus 2 is 1 and here 5 minus 6 is negative 1 and minus 4 minus 5 is negative 9 and here minus 3 minus 2 is minus 5 and 3 4 is a 12 minus 10 is 2 and here it comes 15 plus 8 we can write 23 and again here 4 plus 9 it's a 13 the whole transpose is a cofactor matrix the transpose of the cofactor matrix will be the adjoint so we can write that joint adjoint matrix is 0 transforming the rows to the columns 0 minus 1 and 2 and 2 negative 9 and 23 and 1 negative 5 and 13 is the adjoint of a matrix and we know that a inverse is equal to 1 by delta a that is 1 upon negative 1 times of 0 negative 1 2 2 minus 9 23 and 1 negative 5 and 13 which can also be written 0 1 minus 2 taking minus 1 inside and negative 2 9 and minus 23 and negative 1 5 and minus 13 so this is a inverse
let's solve the system of equations 2x minus 3y plus 5z is equal to 11 3x plus 2y minus 4z is equal to negative 5 x plus y minus 2z is equal to negative 3 so the given equations we can write in matrix form as 2 taking the coefficients of x y z 2 minus 3 plus 5 in the first equation and from second equation 3 2 and negative 4 and from third equation 1 1 and negative 2 into the variables are here x y z which is equal to 11 negative 5 and negative 3 so which is in the form of a x is equal to b and we can find the solution by x is equal to a inverse into b provided that data is not equal to 0 so anyhow here data is equal to minus 1 which is not equal to 0 it's satisfied so we can find and also you can see that 2 negative 3 and 5 3 2 minus 4 and 1 1 minus 2 is is our given matrix a and so that a inverse already we have found so by using a inverse here directly we can write x is equal to a inverse that is 0 1 negative 2 minus 2 9 and minus 23 and minus 1 5 and negative 13 into b matrix is the constant matrix that is 11 negative 5 and negative 3 so upon multiplication the row with column so we will get 0 into 11 it's a 0 1 into minus 5 is minus 5 minus 2 into minus 3 is plus 6 and the next second minus 2 into 11 is minus 22 and 9 into minus 5 is minus 45 and here 23 into 3 is plus 69 and the next one minus 1 into 11 is minus 11 5 into minus 5 minus 25 and 13 3 is 39 so you are getting 6 minus 5 is 1 and here 67 22 plus 45 is 67 minus so you will be getting 2 and here this is 36 this is getting 3 so the variable matrix x is equal to xyz xyz here so we can just compare it both and finally we can conclude that therefore x is equal to 1 y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 3 we can also check by substituting in any one of the equation so in the third equation if you can say third equation if you can substitute x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 2 minus 2 into z is equal to 3 so 1 plus 2 3 3 minus 6 is negative 3 so which is satisfied so we can say the solution x is equal to 1 y is equal to 2, z is equal to 3 okay thank you